probably should put the hat on. What is going on? You guys, it is Saturday morning. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what time it is. Oh, it's about to be 11 o'clock. Um, anywho, today is community day. Okay, so, community day. And they've been, people have been hyping this up for days, been talking about it a lot lately. I haven't said anything about it. Why is my phone being slow? There we go. Give me one second. Um, I will go to GoHub's page because I'm super excited about this announcement that I saw this morning. Okay, so, and this has already happened in a lot of other countries, so people have already been sharing their pictures from it, already been talking about it like crazy, but I'm going to discuss it real quick and then maybe I'll talk about other people who found things. Okay, so community day info number one. Okay, so trainers, here's a quick rundown of tips and tricks observed during the earlier hours of community day events. So basically talking about how other countries have already, you know, experienced their three hours. Okay, so first things first, right off the bat. I am super excited about this because I've been looking for one of these for like the longest time and they're very hard to find. Shiny Pikachu Ray is increased during this event and it's very easy to find a good IV shiny Surfachu. Early reports indicate 10% of the event Pikachu are shiny but sounds a little bit too high. If it is too high, whatever. You know, everybody gets a chance to finally get a shiny Pikachu. That doesn't mean, you know, you're going to go out and find a shiny Magikarp anytime soon. Although that would be really awesome because I do want a shiny magic card so I can evolve to shiny Gyarados at some point in the game. Anyways, next thing. Community Pikachu is very common. It's literally everywhere, so they speak. So I'm sure by the time like 1 o'clock rolls around, because 1 to 4 for my time zone is when the event actually starts. So I'm going to get ready in a little bit, and then I'm probably going to go over to Levitt Park because there's a good amount of stops. There's... there's one gym that's there and then there's a gym that's also like right across the street from it so in case something pops up and you know people are actually in the area a lot of people are going to uh crete park which is like 20 minutes from me i don't know if i really we got invited by the crete facebook group to go there but i'm not thinking i'm gonna go that direction i feel like just kind of staying within my area but i've never been over that direction so anyways back to the bullet points common day spawns vanish immediately after the day after the event is over basically incense and lure are, are prominently attract pikachu so Throw an incense down, throw lures down, because you also are going to have lured spawns, or lured spawns are only going to be there for three hours. Like, or not lured spawns, I mean, like, the lures are only going to last three hours, which is, you know, increase. So, and then it says lured spawns seem smaller than wild spawns, don't miss them. Or all, or at least overwhelming majority Pikachu spawn surf during the event, or spawn during the event will have surf for both bars. Raichu evolved into Surfachu cannot get Surf. Pikachu evolved into Pik or from Pichu cannot or can get Surf. Uh, you can mass select transfer Pik or Surfachu is not considered an event Pokemon. So like, if you're going and like trying to transfer these Pokemon at the end of the event, um, sometimes like certain events, like if it's a if it's a Pokemon for the event, it'll say oh and you've already caught it. It'll ask you if you really want to transfer it after you've already caught it. Like with like Delibird or whatever, like if you transfer that guy, um, it may ask if you really want to transfer him. Or with like just other event Pokemon that you've probably caught. Okay, and then another one. Charge teams can produce Surf on an older Pikachu. And then it kind of goes down to, I really hope they made it as easy to sound to find a shiny Pikachu. Like I hope it's somewhat difficult. Like I hope the first one I don't, you know, click on. And, you know, catch and then go to my bag or my Pokedex to see if it's shiny. I hope it's not like that first one I find. I hope it's like, you know, second or whatever. Supposedly it's really easy and I hope it's not that easy, but we'll see what happens. Okay, so it's about to be 1240. The event starts at 1 o'clock. Um, so I decided I am going to go to Crete Park for a little while. Like I said, it's about a 15 to 18 minute drive from here. Uh, give or take amount, the amount of red lights I had or the speed. Um, but my mom talked me into going to hang out with some of the friends there, and then a lot of the Facebook group talked me into going to go there after I was with some people at a raid, so I'm gonna go there for a little bit, or a little bit, and then I might finish up at Levitt by my house, but we'll see what happens. Anyways, I will just see you guys at the park, hopefully I get enough content for that, I don't know how many people are gonna be there, and I really don't wanna be like, 
the center of attention with the camera by me, so we'll just kind of see what happens. I do want to get as much footage as I possibly can, though, for you guys, so we'll, but like I said, we'll see what happens. At the park, looking for a shiny Pikachu. I've already caught, I don't know how many, but there's a lot of us here too. A lot of the group from my area came to the Crete Park area, so. But I've caught a dumps amount of Pikachu already. I hatched two eggs. One might have been somewhat decent, the other yeah, was crappy, so. The size so. difference? Yeah, the size difference is, some of them are really big and then some of them are really tiny. Well, that's because they just fixed the bug the well, I think GoHub said something earlier about if you see smaller ones, catch them. Because something about the smaller ones versus the larger ones, I don't know. I was just going to catch them all. I'm going to catch everything. Well, I mean, I'm... Yeah, because the big one, the middle one's cool. Uh... The easy way to tell, though, with them is going to your Pokedex, and if you see the little, like, Three little stars by the name. It'll it'll let you know. <sighs> Looking for more Pikachu and nothing else is popping up. It says there's two on the thing. Though. Oh, three on the thing. Too bad we don't have a Kyogre raid going on over here, right? <laughs> you got it, nice. There was one over by my house, the unconcealed bush that like three people reported. Yeah, that's true. Another quick update on shiny Pikachu, still zero. I've caught, I don't know how many. One of my friends, she said she just she's caught like two or three on two different accounts, so. I'm gonna walk this way real quick. Let's see if he's shiny. You got your shiny? Sweet! I don't think that guy was shiny either. We're trying for another one here. Our goal is to get a shiny Pikachu today. I hope it happens. I'm gonna be really bummed if I don't get one. Maybe two though, so that one I can evolve into a shiny Raichu, since I have plenty of candies. Oh, he didn't. Let's try that one more time on this guy. <sighs> Was his IVs good, do you know? No, like 280. Still, I got him, right? Yeah. I'm still looking. I'm gonna get one, that's the goal. Fiona's already caught a couple. You caught one of the other people caught some. Did you get one? Oh my god, everybody's getting shiny. I need one. Well, now there's no Pikachu in the nearby. I have seconds left on my stuff, so I'm gonna have to re-put more incense and everything out. But more people just got shiny, so this is making me feel a lot better about getting a shiny today, so. I'm gonna put some more stuff down real quick though, since all my shit's about to run out. So give me one second. Alright. Lucky egg. Incense. And. Star piece. I won't screen record anything until I find a shiny, so keep in mind this is why I'm not screen recording anything. Another quick update, I'm catching, just caught two more Pikachu, and so far I don't think this one's sh shiny either, sadly. Oh, come on. Nope. Still not shiny. Oh, more, another person, well, a person that I already caught one, she just caught her second shiny so far here. Oh. Let's see what this raid's gonna be. 
Oh, the Whelmer. Just like to check back in with you guys. It is half an hour left on the community day. We've had so many people catch shinies, but myself. I'm being super salty about it. I've had a great time, and it's been a fun experience, but super, super salty. There's probably like four or five of us out of like the main group that haven't caught a shiny yet. It's really disappointing. I've caught, and I'll talk about this. I guess I'll just talk about this more when I talk to you guys at home, so. I'm gonna finish out the event, see what happens, and maybe I'll get lucky, but it's not looking so hot, so. I hope you all have had a great community day, though, and we'll see what happens after this. Well, the event has been over for 17 minutes. I'm headed back home from the park. I'm being super salty when I say this, but I caught over 60 Pikachu at least. Not one of them was a freaking shiny. I'm so like frustrated and irritated, but it, I mean, it's a game. I had a great time. Like it was a cool experience. I'm definitely looking forward to the next community day whenever they do it. Supposedly they're gonna do it every month now. Um, and they're gonna have a special Pokemon every month. It'd be cool if next month was Magikarp so that we could, you know, perhaps get a shiny Magikarp so at least, and you could at least tell the difference. Like every Pikachu I looked at, I mean, like I said, I caught I probably had like seven to ten flea from me, but I mean, they weren't shiny, so it wasn't a big deal. But it's like me and two other good friends of mine that are in the group, we just, everybody else caught a Pikachu except for me and like three other people. So I'm just like, this was absolutely bogus. It's so stupid. But at the same time, I had a great time. It was a fun experience, but Niantic, just, dude, like, it's, it's bogus. Don't. I hate how they tell us we have such a high percentage chance to catch one, but yet, I didn't get one, so. I already do have a shiny Sable, obviously, y'all already know that, but it's like shiny Pikachu, like everybody's dream is, you know, everybody loves Pikachu. He's a useless kind of Pokemon in somewhat of some way, shape, form, but a shiny, like, come on, that, that, it's a rare spawn. Like I said, some people caught, like, two to five today. And like I got robbed three times, like me and my other friend Barb, we got both got her and I both got robbed three times. Like we'd walk up, we'd be like, "Oh, Pikachu!" We go see if it's shiny, not shiny. Someone else would walk up behind us, be like, "Oh, shiny!" So I'm just like, I'm over it. I'm a little irritated still, but it's okay. I got a headache. I'm starving. I need food or I need water too, something. So it says I'll be home in about 11 minutes. So I gotta get home. I gotta change a little bit. Then I gotta go head over to Oak Lawn because I'm hanging out. Jacqueline and her parents tonight, so this video won't be up until way later on. And I'm sorry I don't have any screen recordings. Mile. This is this will probably I'll probably make two videos out of this one vlog because this is just like I said. There's no highlight to this video, or whatever, except for the fact that I got robbed. So 60. I mean, what does it take? You gotta we gotta collect 100 freaking Pikachu before you get a shiny. So, anyways, I will see you guys later on. If I don't see you guys anymore today, I'll just see you guys in the next one.